What's going on people? Look on Avidia, aka Mr. Lukey. Welcome back to the channel and today finding motivation while training at home. Motivation and training at home. Do you know how many times right I get asked this question? Like every day. Like I would these either every day or every other day I get asked this question, you're lucky. I've lost motivation, fam. What do I do? You're lucky. I can't I can't train at home anymore, man. Like ever since this lockdown has started, it's been about six weeks, nearly over six weeks we've been in lockdown and people are like out of their mind. People are like losing the plot. Like people are like it's it's so mad like how people are giving up so easily on training, right, and think that they need the weights to be getting big or they need weights and they need the gym to be being um, determined and more successful or more, you know, productive or more proactive, whatever it is, right, people think they need the gym altogether. The way I look at it, yeah, is you only need the gym, right, you only need the gym for the weights, that's it. It's a thing where people go for, of course, their different intentions like people have different intentions going to the gym you know you got to understand that some people like to go to gym to be sociable some people like to go to gym to lift weights some people like to go to gym to lose weight some people like to go to gym to look good some people just to like to go to gym to forget things in life or some people like to go to gym just for the sake of it you know some people just go because they got time to waste you know everyone has their different different intentions of why they go to the gym you know but again like training at home you know people who regularly go to the gym five days a week six days a week they train at home and now they even they are messaging me saying oh look here i've lost motivation you know i need the weight i don't feel like i'm getting enough in while doing um, these press-ups or these pull-ups and i'll be like look fam at the end of the day it's not about weight all the time you have to realize and understand that why do you go to the gym in the first place? Now, if it's for social reasons, then go call your premier mates and that. Go call up, you know, go speak to your family, go speak to someone where you can have a go and chat to. You know what I mean? It's easy, like, you don't have to be in the gym to be sociable. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can go to the cafes and all that kind of stuff. Of course, they're closed, right? You can go FaceTime your friends, you can go call your friends if you want to be sociable. It's calm. If you're the type of person where I want to get big, yeah, then of course you need weights, yeah. I'm not going to say that you can get big at home, you can, but people think that you can't get big at home, but you can get big at home, but, you know, is this how you go around, you know, working out at home? I can't explain, you know, motivation, right, motivation comes from within. It comes from the person that really wants to make a change for themselves. All the hard work and effort you put in, don't let it go to waste. Just don't let it go to waste. Like you've put that hard work and effort in for God knows how many years, you know, how many months you started, you know, all of a sudden you can be like, oh, I, I ain't got the gym so I, don't, I, can't, I can't get big. I ain't got the gym so I can't lose weight. I ain't got the gym, I can't do this, I can't do that. Right? Don't say that to yourself. Don't put yourself down when you know you can be at home and still be doing, right, lifting weights or, you know, doing press, doing pull-ups, like, you know, um, working out in your garden. You know, working out in your room, working out with your family, working out with your friends you can. You know, some people still go see their friends, it doesn't make a difference, like, just be social distancing from them. People do that shit anyway. Right, it's just the fact that how you go around the situation, you know, how you tell yourself that, look, I need to keep going in a time where depression and motivation and, you know, anxiety and all these kind of things are hitting you at one point. You need to, like, keep going. Like, it's not a thing where... You, you put yourself on hold, you put your life on hold, right, that, you just, you don't do that, you just think to yourself, okay, look, I'm at home, what do I have around me, you know, make the most of the situation that you've got, half the time you're not working, so you have to be productive, you have to go waste time, you know, reading books, now, it doesn't sound stupid, but you know what, start reading books, and start opening your mind up to other things, you know, we're too busy on social media, and we see a lot of things on social media which you know puts us down even more so social media is one thing where you need to like 
take a step back from and then understand that you need to fix yourself up first. If you haven't got weights, you got body weight. If you haven't got a treadmill, you go in the garden, you start jogging in the garden, or you start doing his circuits in the garden. If you have people who are boxing, go get a boxing bike, put a walk in your garden. You know what I mean? Go order one. You know, you could do shadow boxing in the garden, you could do skipping rope in the garden. So many things you could do like for boxing as well. Like the way I keep motivated is I watch videos. You know, the way I stay motivated with training is I watch my old videos. Um, I watch uh, people who inspire me on YouTube, and uh, you know, just these type of people will inspire me. Thinking, you know, I need to carry on with what I'm doing because, of course, that some there are some days I lose motivation in training, but even then, I still carry on. You know, I'll go watch a video and it pumps me up, thinking, you know. I should be doing that, even though the gym's closed, I should be doing that at home, regardless, right? So, that's one thing, like, I do is watch videos, um, I look at old pictures, now, when I look at my old pictures, when I was in good shape, you know, I think to myself, you know, I could be back in that position again, but how do I get there, you know? Now, I haven't got, you know, the gym factor in my life right now, so, okay, look, I'm going to try another thing, you know, I set myself a goal again, to lose weight, while not having weights around me, try to try different things, learn new things. You know, motivation comes from putting putting goals in your life, right? To whatever goals it is, if you want to make money, you can't go to work. How do you make money? Try to find a new source of making money at home. Trying to lose weight, can't go to the gym, try to lose weight at home. If you want to learn a new language, you can't go to a class, you can do the class at home on YouTube. Right? You can learn a new language at home. Reading books, you can't go to the library, right? But download an app and you can, you know, read books from an app. Like Kindle and all that kind of stuff. So, you find alternatives to set yourself a goal. Again, goal is, setting goals is the key uh, factor in motivation. Whether it's training, whether it's work, whether it's your life or whatever it is, that's the key factor in Having motivation in yourself to keep going with what you want, what you want to do, and what you are doing, All right? So motivation, you know, you need to find it, man. Just, just don't overthink it. It's simple. Just carry on. Just don't be lazy. Laziness is what's going to kill you. Don't get too comfortable. Being comfortable in a position is not a good thing because then you won't start pushing yourself again. To be motivated, you need to push yourself to get better than yesterday. To be better than before. Or to be better, you know, in the future. So this is a thing where being lazy is not something you should be doing. Like I said, man, stay strong, stay positive-minded. You know, seek happiness in what you ever, whatever it is that you want to do. Go find the happiness. Just find an alternative solution. You know, every problem there is, there are, there is a solution to solving that problem. So again, whatever it is in your life that you are, you know thinking about or whatever it is that you are unsure of again look look at the situation you know find a solution boom that's it you go back out there and carry on with it again you know so that's all I have to say on motivation you know I do get a lot of people messing me about it like if you want to speak to me about motivation or what you can do then direct message me I'll speak to you uh, one to one I don't mind doing that if you like this video give it a thumbs up like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all soon. Peace.